Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. Yes, another rank up video. I told you guys, I went crazy, having so much fun ranking up champions. So we're gonna start this one off a little bit differently. Uh, I've got this six star rank up gem that I bought for units uh, that offer uh, that we had not that long ago. And that's gonna be your hint. So after this opens, feel free to pause the video and leave a comment at who you think I'm taking up now, all right? It's slowing down. This is going to be the only hint you get. So what do we got? Mystic. So that is your hint, but we are about to reveal it in five, four, three, two, one. Hey, who guessed that one? Well, if you did, you're wrong. Psych! Here's the real rank up. You should have known better because this guy is rank one, where Sorcerer Supreme is already ranked two. And we're going to use this gem on El Diablo. Boom. Who would have thought that I would be taking up Diablo? Wow. All right, so as I am ranking him up, uh, I will have my assistant uh, explain what's going on, why I'm ranking him up, and what we're going to do with him in the future. El Diablo, from meme to hero. Diablo is now a poison god. Now, I know Diablo personally, and I can't tell you how many nights he lay in his bed crying over the lack of respect. He knew he was capable of so much more, but he was being oppressed, held back by the powers that be. And so, not able to take it any longer, he waged a war, a silent war. Most people were not aware of it, but he fought and he fought. He wanted to regain his power, the power that was locked away from him. And he was victorious. Now, he is no longer a joke. Now, he is no longer a meme. Diablo is truly a poison god. If you go up against anyone that is not poison immune or poison resistant or they benefit from poison, you want to use Diablo. Not only does he have very powerful poisons, but he also takes less damage when he has a poison. Not just any poison, but the poison that comes from liquid courage. Yes, he has in his kit the ability to benefit from the suicide masteries. That is what really attracted my partner here, Lord Shadow, to Diablo. He never considered taking Diablo up. When he got Diablo as a six star, Rank one is where that Diablo was going to stay. Then he duped Diablo. It was like the game was telling him to rank Diablo, but he refused. But now, now it's all done. Diablo takes his place as one of the newest 
rank three six stars in Lord Shadow's roster. Now we're going to have a little fun with Diablo. We're gonna see what those poisons can do. Was he worth the rank up? I say yes. All right. My latest rank three six star is El Diablo. Who would have thought a poison god? That buff did him right. So now, well, let's take a look at him real quick before we get to the uh, gameplay. So you guys can see uh, his health and all that attack. Switch over to percentages so you can see his stats there. And uh, we're just going to kind of scroll through his uh, abilities here. And let me check something real quick. Yep, changed my prestige. My prestige went up, not a lot. Uh, it went up, looks like mm, about 30, 30 something points. Uh, it went up, won't stay there, but it is a prestige boost for right now. All right, so let's get on to the gameplay. All right, let's see what this guy can do. Now you see the team I'm going in here with, the only synergy is Mephisto. And that lets uh, Diablo's poisons uh, reduce healing by 50% instead of 30%. The others, Shang-Chi, uh, Cosmic Ghost Rider, Hercules, they're only to get me through all the other fights until Wolverine. So we're going to fight Winter Soldier with Diablo. But of course, the next matchup, they're poison immune and not really an uh, interesting fight in any case. So I fight Winter Soldier, and I got a, shoot, a few things to show you during this fight, and then we'll go over to Wolverine. All right, so in this fight, don't look for crazy gameplay because I don't know how to use Diablo yet. All right, so one of the things I was trying to get him to do, which he was playing a little bit more passively than I liked, uh, was so I could parry him and get a heavy off. And he was doing everything he could to keep me from getting a parry. So I just started attacking him and said, you know what, I'll just fire off my special one. Now, I want you to notice something throughout this fight. Watch Diablo's health throughout the fight. And also watch those numbers, those poison numbers, because they are crazy. You know, don't look at just one. Look at the fact that there are several going. Total them up. And as you can see, parry heavy and apply poisons. Now, I could have done that, kept the hit count low, and killed him that way. But that wasn't all that fun. So I went through. Um, I fired off my special one. You see I'm back at full health. That one I fired off a special two just to kind of, you know, see what it can do. And I'm going to also fire off a special three. But in the meantime, we're just fighting him like normal. Look at his health, though. Look at Winter Soldier's health. Look at Diablo's health. One thing that I will say, fighting Winter Soldier, I felt completely safe. Now, look at that. You saw I got hit, right? Look at my health. I just got hit by Winter Soldier. Look at my health. That's Diablo the Diablo of today. Not the meme tier Diablo, but the poison god, the one that I took to rank three Diablo. Just look at that. Okay, his health, I was never in danger. I didn't feel like I was ever in danger. You know, I got hit, okay. Uh, one of the things that I really like since I run suicides all the time, he is so sustainable. Now look at what that did. That put a ton of poisons on the opponent crazy and i believe uh diablo he takes less damage when they have more poisons and i think he does more damage when they have more poisons on them uh and just look at that we just decimated winter soldier look at this that is just ridiculous and he finished with a full bar of health 
All right, so that's it for that fight. Now for the fight that I was really curious about and why I brought Mephisto, just to make it easier, but I really didn't need it. Uh, Mephisto was not needed, but it's nice that you can just put a couple of poisons and shut down Wolverine. But as you'll see here, like right here, he's shut down completely. He can't heal, all right? But I get so many poisons on him that it wouldn't matter. And if you have the Despair Mastery as well, which I do, yeah, he, you're not gonna worry about that heal. And you know how powerful Wolverine's heal is. And if you don't, go in there and find out. If you do not have a proper counter for this guy, you're not gonna finish him. You're gonna get stopped right here. Uh, I went up against him with Hercules, wondering if I could out damage him. And you can, but you gotta get a little lucky. Diablo doesn't have to get lucky. Look at Diablo's health, by the way. And I could have done this fight several different ways. But once you have Wolverine's con uh, healing under control, it's just a regular uh, Wolverine fight. As long as you know how to fight him and, and evade his specials, you're good. All right? And see, just look at this. Just melting him. And look at the damage. When he has all those poisons on him, look at the damage. Not just the poison damage, but look at the hit damage that Diablo was doing. Insane. And look at his health bar. Diablo is crazy now. So hopefully you can see why I took Diablo to rank three. All right. And I'm going to learn more about him and I'll probably do a video on him as well. Uh, but man, I am so impressed with Diablo. It is not funny. But that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. What do you think about Diablo? And you all have a blessed day.